Today, September 18, marks the third anniversary of the massacre committed by the Houthi militia against nine innocent people from Tehama on malicious charges. Houthi killing came out of hatred to take revenge on the people of Tehama and the free Yemenis who resisted the authority of the imami and defeated its racist project. The following report has more details. On September 18, 2021, a horrific crime was recorded in the memory of Yemenis when the sons of Tehama were executed on the guillotine of the new imams in a scene that expresses the cruelty of history and the repetition of its tragedies. Ten pure souls of the first of which was a victim of torture inside prison cells, while nine others were executed in Tahrir Square in the kidnapped capital Sana'a. The Houthis falsely claimed that they were involved in the killing of the so-called head of their political council, Saleh Hassamad. These actions were a hateful revenge against the people of Tihama. <laughs> It was one of those arrested from their homes and falsely and unjustly accused of killing a Sammar with my other colleagues who were executed. I was released from the Houthi militia prison by the International Justice Organization. We were subjected to torture and threats. I was part of the media delegation accompanying a Samad in his presidential convoy and his car was replaced by another one during his visit to the university and exploded after 15 minutes and there were no airstrikes. People's eyes were saturated with tears, who were assassinated by the Houthis with brutal force, who exploited the umbrella of the judiciary for their bloody purposes, shed the blood and the souls of the Yemenis without mercy. Although three years have passed since the massacre, the memory of these martyrs is still alive in the hearts of the people of Tihama and Yemen in general. In the liberated areas of Hodeidah, Banners denouncing this crime remain raised in the streets and public places to be a constant reminder of the need to resist injustice and tyranny. The halter in the hearts of the imamis continues until now and they target the innocent people of Tahama in a crime that the Houthis committed and presented the people of Tahama as sacrifices to cover up their crime. By committing this crime, the Houthis seek to terrorize the Yemenis and consolidate the authority of the reactionary imamate, which used to oppress its opponents before the September Revolution in 1962. The Houthis did not choose the month of September randomly to execute the sons of Tihama, in which the glorious September, the regime of the imamate ended and the Republic of Yemenis was risen. On this painful anniversary, the promise is renewed that the blood of the martyrs will not be shed in vain and that the voice of truth will continue to resound in the face of injustice until justice is achieved, the people triumph over their oppression and the homeland is restored from the hands of the priest who tamper with its system, security and stability.